All right, guys. This is quite possibly the worst Mahjong game I have seen in my entire life. <laughs> um, I found. I don't know if you guys can hear the sound, but you're not missing much. It's pretty much the same exact uh, five chords or whatever playing over and over. They kind of sound Chinese, so I guess that's what they were doing. But yeah, as you can see, we've got President Barack Obama, uh, Secretary of State Hillary Clinton, and former President George W. Bush. Uh, we are, a, I guess, some Mahjong pro who has taught these guys. Th I'm injecting my own story into this game because it makes no sense to me. But uh, apparently we're just some guy who is playing Mahjong with these offensive stereotypes of um, American leaders. Uh, and yeah, that's the game. Oh, and we're playing Mahjong, of course. Uh, so basically the rules are very simplistic. Uh, you can fire a cannon, which is Ron, you know. Uh, you can winnings, which is Zimo or Zimo. You can ready hand, which is ridiculously stupid because like there's no scoring in this game other than like Rones are worth 200 points and sumos are worth 300 points uh, so there's no point in uh, reaching or calling ready at all uh, <laughs> uh, and you've got your cheese your kongs and your uh, pons you know ji gong ping whatever so yeah let's get right into it Come on. Okay, okay. Yeah, that did that the first time too. Okay, so everything's in English, which makes it even worse. And here's like the reason that I like fucking wanted to do this get like kind of let's play this game, because there is like I don't know how many tiles of like the seven honor tiles, and there's like apparently an infinite amount of each tile or something. I don't know. I haven't even counted because there's like so many of each tile. So you'll like the differences in like which tile to wait on based on what's on the board are like ne negligible because there's probably going to be plenty of each tile. Um, and Kongs happen a lot because of that. Um, this is actually a pretty bad hand <laughs> in this game. Um, there's. I don't know. This is like a really bare bones mahjong with, like, I don't know, for people who really do not understand mahjong at all. Okay, so now you can see that President Barack Obama just dealt into Hillary Clinton's hands. It, Hillary Clinton's hand. And as you can see, like, uh, like, in normal mahjong, like, if you have, like, uh, the only situation that, where this would come up with is, is in Chi Toitsu, Seven Pairs. Uh, but, like, uh, in regular Mahjong, like, if you have, like, four of a single tile, those don't count as two pairs. But in this game, like, Hillary's um, row of five tiles, five hakus here, uh, counts as a pair and a triplet in this messed up rule. So she actually has a, uh, a weight on uh, tone and haku, which I would have dealt into if Obama hadn't done it for me. <laughs> so... Um, but yeah, if you don't hear anything right now, I'm sorry, I'll try to get better stuff, uh, but you're seriously not missing anything. It's just the same four lines of music over and over on an endless loop. Oh, and they're laughing too. They're going, <laughs> which is totally uncharacteristic of, um, uh, Secretary of States and Presidents alike, so... Uh, yeah, this is basically the whole game, <laughs> it's just, uh, now normally you wouldn't, like, I think I will pung on the fifth Hatsu, so I can have a ton and Haku wait, Hatsu wait, okay, here's the stupidest thing in the entire game, you can call a ready hand, you can call Rishi, um, and I'll just show you what it does. Basically, it's exactly like Rishi. Okay, well, it it he dealt in immediately, so I get, didn't get to show you. But basically, if it had gone around to me, I would have had to deal what, deal what I drew. 
uh, and as you can see, it's still uh, 200 points for me. It would still be the same if I had not reached it. So there is absolutely no point in reaching whatsoever, especially because there's no strategy in this game. These are just mindless robots like mashing tiles, and they probably won't like actually take anything into consideration like if you threaten them with a Rishi. So basically my strategy here is not to Rishi ever. Uh, Kong every opportunity it gives me unless like a situation here where like uh, no I, I could actually Kong here I think I will um, but unless it would like detract from the speed of my hand I Kong every time. That's my basic general strategy with this game. And you can tell when they're in Tenpai because they've got their ready hand things. Uh, and in normal Mahjong, this non would be totally safe, but there's like an infinite amount amount of each tile, so there's like there's nothing safe at all right now. Uh, okay, <laughs> there's no point in folding. I'll just play this. Okay, it went through. Okay, everyone is in Tenpai except me. There you go. <laughs> okay. So yeah, there's like no strategy at all to this game. Alright. Uh, oh, and you can't choose where you want a Kong. It just picks one for you. So that's kind of stupid. Um, I guess the tone has slightly more tiles left in it so we'll play that oh I didn't even notice Obama was in Rishi I mean ready uh, this will probably go through oh thanks Mr. Bush Mr. President <laughs> Mr. Ex-President George W. Bush <laughs> this game is so stupid <laughs> um I want to Kong on the Shah here, but I don't want to Kong on the Nons, because that would be dumb. So I'm just going to not do it. Um, yeah. Okay, I guess there's a little bit of strategy to this game, but nothing, nothing really. Now see, this looks like a Yakuman hand to me right here, even in the world of this game where there is an infinite amount of each tile and there's only honor tiles. This all wins thing seems like a Yakuman to me, but no, it's just a normal hand. Oh, I dealt into uh, Miss Secretary of State Hillary Clinton's hand. Oh, well. <laughs> uh, oh boy. <laughs> that happens a lot too. No one gets to draw anything in someone's Zimos because there's like absolutely no uh, like variety in the hands. Oh, I'm already in Tenpai. Look at that. I'm gonna call Rachi here for variety. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully, eventually, I'll get to show you what happens when it goes around to my turn while I'm in Rachi. I guess I should be reaching every time I get to Tenpai for that purpose, but uh, it's not even reaching, it's just fucking letting them know. Alright, ready! Yes. Okay, no. It didn't go around to me. Yeah, see, I, I didn't even click there, it just played it for me. So there's like zero point in reaching. It just puts you at a disadvantage. All right, winnings! Woohoo! <laughs> yeah, and as you can see, sumos are worth more than rones. They're worth 300. So I, I guess, I don't know. It's really not worth it to pass up on a roan though. Um. Oh, I get. Uh, I'm in Tenpai right now. Like normally in normal mahjong, I wouldn't be, but here I am. I'm waiting on either. I can go into Tenpai waiting on a Haku or a Hatsu. I think I'll choose the Haku because I got one pair, two pair, three pair, four pair, five pair, six pair, and there's my seventh pair right there. 
So yeah, this is like the dumbest game of all time. Um, I don't know, maybe you could use it to get your friends who know nothing about Mahjong into the game. Because it's a, basically a tile matching game and nothing else, but... I mean... It's... I don't know, for, for me who's played Mahjong so much, it is absolutely... <laughs> I don't know, it's just funny. <laughs> So yeah. Oh man. She fired the cannon. And you can submit your score at the end, which is how many people actually play this. The only reason that I found this. Hey, watch your language, Mr. President. <laughs> That's not cool. Oh, oh, I won. I didn't even notice that I was in Chitoitsu Tempai there. <laughs> uh, yeah, the only reason I found this was because I saw it on Nico Nico video. Uh, like someone said, oh, this is the, uh, this is sort of kind of like uh, Murazumo Naki Kaikaku, you know, Legendary Koizumi. And I was like, oh, that sounds interesting. And I saw Obama. Hillary Clinton and Bush, and I was like, yeah, I gotta get this. And it turned out to be just as bad as I was expecting it would be. So, yeah. <laughs> and I, I'm pretty much recording this, like, right after I first got my experience with it. Oh, man. Dealt right into Miss Secretary of State's hand. So yeah, I've had like seven of the same tile in a row, and it counted as like a tr like a triplet and a kong. I think that happened in this recording session actually, but I I did it once before as well. I don't know. You could probably work out how many of each tile there are in the hand. Like just divide the number of tiles in mahjong. But, but the, you know, the walls don't even move. Oh, oh uh, yeah, they do, actually. Never mind. But, I mean, you could divide the number of tiles in Mahjong by seven and figure out, like, oh, there's, like, there's 60 of each tile in this entire game. There's probably not that many, but, like, in the double digits of each tile in this game. Uh... So I should be getting Toy Toy every single time here, but um, this is very bare bones. Okay, <laughs> I pretty much run out of things to say at this point. Um, oh, nice. Did the one I wanted it to. I'll submit my score after this hand and see um, what happens. It's very rare for a session like that. To, I mean, a series of tiles to go through like that. Usually everyone pawns on everything. Oh, she's ready, man. No, I've got seven. I've got eight <laughs> hakus. I can't. I can't do a promoted kong. That's dumb. Oh my lord! Yeah, another thing about this game is like there's no dialogue. Everything's just symbols. Though, I don't know. I wouldn't expect witty and creative commentary from this game. All right, let's submit the score. See what happens. Come on. I bet it's going to open a browser, right? Oh, it's probably because I'm on the Mac. I'm uh, using a... Yeah, I can't submit my score. But yeah, that is 2211FRTY uh, tilde uh, underscore real underscore ZYS. Uh, yeah, really rolls off the tongue. So yeah, thanks.